Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I got a huge order of ColourPop stuff and so I decided to do a little, you know, look for you all. And this was the look that I came up with. It kind of graduates from this like apricot color to like this really pink peachy color, kind of like a really good sherbet um, fusion. So I just decided to do that. I also got a couple things from e.l.f. that I managed to incorporate in this video. So I used a bronzer and a blush that came in a duo that's a cream it was my first time working with creams and i gotta say i'm a fan i love it i also got a couple of lip colors from ColourPop, so you'll see later on in the video um me do a bit a couple of swatches so if you like any of those colors you know ColourPop, the price can't be beat go ahead and get you some so if you like this look and you want to see how i do it stay tuned the first shadow I'm going to use is ColourPop's Press Shadow in the color Cut Out. And I'm just going to put this in the crease of my eye. Next for my lid, I'm going to go in with the color The News. And I'm just going to place this all over my lid. Next, using a little bit of Mario Badescu spray, I'm going to use the color Savage and press that in the middle of my eyelid all the way to almost the outer corner of my eye. Next, I'm gonna go back in with the color Cut Out and place that back on the outer corner of my eyes in my crease and just blend it out. Hmm, where should I use this last eyeshadow? I don't want to use it on my bottom lash line. I know. I'm going to put it in my inner corner. So I'm going to put the color Broad Shorts on almost the middle of my eye to my inner corner. Next, I'm going to go in with some eyeliner and just use it on my lower lash line and my waterline. And next, I'm going to use some liquid eyeliner and just create a wing. And then marry it to my lower lash line to create a seamless liner. Now for my face, I'm going to use Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and just highlight my face, going in under my eyes, my nose, my chin, and my forehead, per usual. And now I'm just going to blend that all out. To set that highlight, I'm going to use Laura Mercier's Translucent Setting Powder. And to wipe that off, I'm going to go in with my TARDIS Contour Palette and use the correct color to dust off that powder. So I got this new e.l.f. sculpting face brush and I'm going to use that along with their aqua infused blush and bronzer set. And the brush smells actually really good. I was surprised as you can see and I had to check the title one more time. Now I'm just going to bronze out the hollows of my cheeks, my forehead, my nose, and my chin and my jawline using this e.l.f. bronzer. Now I'm actually going to use the blush part of that aqua infused blush and bronzer from e.l.f. and put that all over my cheeks. I also got a highlighting kit from ColourPop called Give Me More and it's their pressed powder highlighters. So I'm actually going to go in with the highlighter called Total Package and use that on my brow bone. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
for my actual highlight, I'm going to go in with the color extra and put that on my cheekbones. Next, I'm going to go in with the highlighter full service and put that all over my cheekbones. And then I go a bit crazy with highlighter again and I add total package again. Adding my Casually Glam Eyelore Eyelashes. And I'm going back in with the color cutouts for my lower lash line. Filling in my beauty mark. And now for all my lippies. So I got three lip colors and one lip primer. So using ColourPop's Lippy Stick Primer. And the first liquid lipstick I'm going to use is the color Viper. <laughs> Whoa. Now I'm going in with the color Bumble. And last but not least, the color Virginia. So this is the completed look. I think it turned out pretty well. I just was playing around and you know, only had three shades of pink, one shade of like gold. So I decided to mesh it together and I kind of think it looks like a sherbet. Like it's like, like apricot turned into pink. So it's like one of those like really good like ice cream sherbets and those summer, now that summer's coming to an end, just one last summer look before we head into fall. You know, one last time for the summertime. I hope you enjoyed all of the little ColourPop goodies I had. Like, how amazing was this highlight set? Like, six colors. I think it was for $12. So, it's like $3 a highlight. You can't beat that. And then all the lippies I got. So, I ended up going with Viper. I also thought that Virginia looked really good with the look as well. So, Virginia is one of the um, collaborations between K. Ritchie and ColourPop. Um, this is an ode to our character on Claws. If any of you watch that show, it's, she does like a really good job at playing that character. Like she's very believable. Maybe I should do like a Claws inspired makeup look. Well, I don't know, that ship has sailed. Um, but thank you all for watching this. If you like this look, if you like me, you know what to do. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Leave a comment. Let me know if you like this video. If you want more ColourPop collaborations. Um, if you want more e.l.f. products. Thank you for watching this video. And thank you for watching me. As always, see you soon. Bye.